And now it's time for today's guest. Hartley Sawyer is the star of CW series The Flash. Based on the DC comics, Hartley takes on the role of Ralph Dibney, aka the Elongated Man. Take a look. Simple. We blast him. We blast him? If you blast him, right? The vibration or jolt, it will be more than enough to kickstart his consciousness, I'm sure of it. Can't we just play some Gaga and hope he wakes up? <laughs> Gaga is not the solution to everything. You have to blast him. I'll young Ralph Macho, please. Be careful, this could get a little ugly. Sorry, Dibs. Oh. Voila! Good as no. Blast him why you happen what? Mm -hmm. Blast him why you happen what? Except for the language skills. Those will return, probably. Come on. Everybody going where is? Everybody going where it, every... What is it? It's the wood particles you guys found. Swiss ash. Everyone, please give a warm Bill Brunch welcome to Hartley Sawyer. <laughs> Woo! Thank you for having me. Oh, thanks for being here. So tell us, tell us about season five of The Flash. What's it like to be on this hit CW show? Before I do that, let me try, I've never... Oh, yes. This oh, yes. The, You've never had? The oh. controversial... The con yes. Aperol spritz. Oh my God. Cheers. Oh my gosh. Okay, cheers. 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 Yeah, cheers. Yeah, cheers. cheers. I'm pretty drunk at half of mine. Yeah, I, I was noticing that. So I will say yeah. it needs a little, little more soda. <laughs> yeah. But. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Here, just vomit on me. It's no, it's. It's, it's a little mouthwash. Not a professional bartender made this. No offense to the producer to me. Right. We love oh. you. Come on. I mean, so let's be real now. Like, if we went to professional bar. It would it have would a little be, more soda, a little more It would more be crisp. like 3% better. Yeah. 3% better. Yeah. And that makes a drink sometimes. It's a little cough syrupy, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. God. It's bad, Brittany, we lost right? this. I feel yeah. bad. One more. I feel bad that I made our producers make this because I hadn't <laughs> tried it before. And here we are, and you're our guest, and we're making you drink it. I'm so sorry. No, don't be sorry. It's great. It's yeah. great. New experiences. Yeah. Cool yeah, new shirt. Experiences. Thank you very yeah. much. I love that shirt. It's a Nirvana shirt. Oh, wow. Edgy. 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 Yeah. What's going on in your shirt? It's like... uh, oh, it's a sacrifice. It's just a couple kids hanging out. Let's, like, let's <laughs> little Toby. It's one of my favorite shit. It's a little edgier. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, a yeah, a little, little bit. bit. Yeah, a little bit. But you know what? We're not here to talk about edginess. We're here to talk about the flash. The flash. <laughs> Tell us. <laughs> Tell what do you want to know? Um, do you like being on the show? Do you like talking about it? Um, what's no, it like to be hate being on it. Man? Hate talking oh, about I it. Yeah, 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 I'll just I go. I hate doing press, too. What do you want to talk about? Anything. Anything? anything? Okay. No, I love being on the show. Um, <laughs> I, I like talking about it a lot, yeah. Yeah. Were you a fan know. before you got involved? I hadn't really seen much of it. I'd seen, I think, the pilot, but I was a comic book fan. Mm -hmm. I grew up reading comic books. Sweet. So What's your favorite comic book? Uh, of all time? Mm-hmm. Probably Batman Arkham Asylum Serious House on Serious Earth. Oh, Ooh. nice. Oh. Yeah. That's Eat a cut. great, great book. Yeah. Has anybody read it? Yes. Anybody? Yeah, it's a great book. Your fans wow. are like... We know it's they're they're lying. Lying. They're like, yeah. yeah, we read it. They're going to go read it now. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I grew up reading comic books, so I was very excited to be part of the comic book world. Awesome, yeah. Fan, I feel like comic book fans are super diehard. Have you had any like cool encounters with people being very intense? I've had a lot of people who have asked me if we're going to change the name Elongated Man. Oh. oh, yeah, what's up with it? It's a fun to say. Why would they change it? I think people think that it just seems a, it's a little bit on the nose, right? Like a longer <laughs> man, yeah. but that's what they decided in 1960, so we can't really do anything yeah. about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I gotta stay true to the character. Yeah, I like it. And the like source it. material. Um, I, this is such a cool show, of course, on CW. And CW has kind of become the home towards these superhero, these yeah. teen superhero shows, which has really kind of brought a whole new genre to television. The finale air, season five finale airs tomorrow, May yeah. 14th. Yes. I know you can't clearly give stuff away, but can you tease anything that we should be looking out for, looking forward to? I think one of the things that I'm super excited for is rever anything with Reverse Flash. Like, I love right. the Reverse Flash. I love, I think that's one of the great villains in, in any of the movies or the TV shows that have been done with superheroes. I think Tom Cavanaugh does an amazing job, and being able to work with him as Reverse Flash this year has been mm. really exciting for me. 
Yeah, speaking of that, so how is it working with this cast, with your fellow castmates? It seems like it's a really would be a really fun show. It is. Because yeah. I imagine like when I like when when you watch the behind the scenes like Lord of the Rings, whatever, like with, before the special effects go in, it's like it's so weird almost. And I imagine with this show too, it's like you have to like imagine you're seeing something happening that's not actually happening. Well, yeah, like the the clip that we just showed when we shot it, I'm just yeah. kind of like rolling around, <laughs> the ground, like, screaming like an yeah. idiot. And a lot of that stuff that I do is just it would look it looks so weird before we do VFX and then some of the stuff Grant does, like when he makes tornadoes, like he's just literally right. doing, this. <laughs> just doing this. And then they make it look cool, but it's so much fun. Right. It's so yeah. much fun. I get along really well with the cast and they and they made it easy coming in. It was intimidating to come in last right. year in this, you know, huge show that's so established and just want to fit into it, but yeah. they made it easy. And how was the atmosphere for uh, in general filming a season finale? Is it like thank God the school year's over kind of thing, or like, oh, this is sad, My, I have to go on hiatus now. It's both. It's like you're, it's, it's like a nine or ten month shoot, so you're excited to have a little bit of breathing room. Right. Yeah. But we all really like what we do, so we're excited. You know, you're gone for like two weeks, and you're like, oh, I'm ready to go back. Mm -hmm. you know, right. Ready to do it again. Yeah. Play make-believe for a living in this yeah. world. It's super fun. What are some of your favorite parts about playing the elongated man? I think the fact that I can do things that are different than any other character can do, and I don't necessarily mean in terms of even the powers, the abilities, but I can just say things I think that other characters don't, it wouldn't really ring true with those characters mm -hmm. to say. Yeah. And I really enjoy doing that. Um, I also get the freedom, we all kind of get the freedom to ad lib a lot, which is something that I really enjoy. Oh, really? Yeah, I mean, there's so much stuff that'll never make it in the show because it's like rated R and yeah. bombs and everything <laughs> like that. But right, like all of a sudden you're curb your enthusiasm, you guys yeah. are just like improvising. <laughs> oh yeah, there's so much, five, five, shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all the time, but they don't put that in. Maybe one day we'll Maybe. get like the R rated cut. But, yeah. <laughs> And how do you prepare for a role like this? What is your sort of process? When I, you know, the funny thing is when I auditioned for Ralph, it was in my mind the worst audition I'd ever given in my entire life. Why? Wow. It was a, well, I had this experience where they changed the audition time that day. Uh -huh. And so when I got to the gate, I got there like 45 minutes early to go to the studio to audition for the producers and read for the showrunners. And when I got to the gate, security was like, yeah, we don't have your name. Mm. And I was like, okay, cool, no, no, no problem, <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. He was, I was like, what do I do? He's like, pull over and call your agent. So I pulled over, called my agent, 20 minutes go by, 22 minutes goes by, 25 minutes goes by, my audition's now nine minutes away, and he finally, he's like, okay, go in. So I finally go, I park, I have to walk into the studio, I get in there, I go upstairs, um, my bladder is about to explode. <laughs> and I think I'm just gonna go to the restroom and then go in, and I walk into the audition room and nobody's in there. Jeez. So nobody's waiting, there's nobody before me. And I grab the bathroom key and the casting assistant comes out and she goes, um, are you ready? And she was nice, but she was like, are you? and I was like, oh, can I just, she's like, you're the last one, they're waiting. Oh, yeah. I, oh, I, I, oh, dear God <laughs> almighty. So with a very full bladder mm -hmm. and a very full heart, <laughs> I went in and I gave this audition and they were all like, thank you very much, thank you. And I left and I was like, I'm ruined. Like, I'm right. done. Like, that was yeah. awful. And then got the call they wanted to meet with me again, and here we are. Wow. So was your reaction, were you so surprised when you got that call? I had written it off as one of the worst experiences I ever had Jeez. as an actor auditioning. So I just kind of, like, moved on from it. And I think it was four or five days later they wanted to meet with me. Wow. Wow. And that was kind of mystifying. Yeah. yeah. You know? That there was. might have been some urgency in your performance mm -hmm. that helped. You know? It's like the episode <laughs> like, of Friends when Joey is yeah. a full bladder and then gets the part. It's exactly like that. Yes, it's exactly <laughs> like that. But I think what actually happened there was I was just kind of like, well, fuck it, you know, yeah. like, let's just do this. What was it like the first time you put on the, the suit? I had an, the original suit I had was very different than the one mm -hmm. I have now. It was like a. Um, like a onesie kind of thing, like it's a one piece, like skin tight thing. Yeah. That one was so different than the one that I have now. The one that I have now, when I first put that on, that was a very cool moment. Mm -hmm. I was like, huh, I have like a superhero suit. Like I have like a thing yeah. and this button that I still don't know what it does. <laughs> we haven't established that yet, but there it is, the button. We don't know what that does. <laughs> oh, we're gonna. Mm -hmm. I tell myself it's Just a morphine like drip. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Convenient. <laughs> and before we go, uh, I know that now you'll have a little time off. And I, looking at your Instagram, you have like a really important relationship with your dog. I do, yeah. I love dogs probably more than anything. Yeah, it's so special. So do you have any fun summer plans? Because if you have some time off. Uh, I don't have a lot of summer plans. I mean, um, I travel a lot for work anyway. Yeah. So I'm going to do some traveling. I'll be back in New York to see some family. I'll probably go to Europe a little bit. Yeah. But um, mainly I'm going to try to be with my dogs. And I volunteer a lot at the animal shelter. Yeah, so I saw I'm gonna, that. Uh, 
spend as much time doing that as I possibly can I love on it. one break. So cute. That's great. That's so nice. Well, have fun, and thank you so much for being here. Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.